Hello, everyone. My name is Aaron. Great. And I am Dan. <laughs> uh, and given how uh, my lack of recording equipment over at my house has worked out, I'm probably looking like I'm coming to you from a highly pixelated 1994 <laughs> Commodore 64 computer. It looks okay. It looks okay. I mean, does, you're always does handsome. It look all right? It's just. Oh, you're always handsome. Uh, I remember so someone uh, referred to me as Jewish Bigfoot in these videos. <laughs> so hopefully uh, it's it's reasonably okay. Yeah, I can't wait till we get on a well-lit stage again. We're, we're watching a compilation of, uh, of B-Drill moments and uh, which, are, which are interspersed with some of your comments that we're also going to be looking at. So I uh, hope you enjoy. Let's get to it. Time to bring out the big guns. <laughs> So they can suck it hard. Often found in forests and grasslands, Weedles... Oh, my, my bad. I'm gonna give a nickname to Weedle. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm gonna name what a him, memory. Uh, Deedle? No, I'm gonna name him... Uh... Bun... Bundle? Bunt? Bunt. Bunt. Oh, <laughs> like the cake? <laughs> but backwards. Bunt. So bunt. <laughs> yeah, I like it. And then I, and then I come... <laughs> <laughs> Bun. You know, I honestly couldn't remember if the comment, if the comma was deliberate or not. So I'm glad I was reminded that yes, it was indeed deliberate. Yeah, God, I mean, like the the first thing that jumps out at me is how young we were when we were doing this. Oh. Like that was what seven years ago. Gosh, it feels like a different lifetime now. Well, according to this comment, the first comment is three years ago. No, this comment was posted three years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so the legend of that bee drill begins. Yeah, it's true. It's beautiful. Something beautiful. Let's take a look at another comment. Oh, uh, Shana Sahota said, if only a Weedle was a grass Pokemon, then it'd be a Weedle. <laughs> 420, blaze it, but responsibly and only in states where it's legal, please. <laughs> and then also uh, Indigo Dancer, I'm going to catch a Weedle just out of spite. Apparently I said that and... Uh, well, that was the beginning. That was the beginning of the end for us in that playthrough. For those who don't, for those who don't know, uh, this this B drill, you're gonna you're gonna learn pretty quickly. Uh, this B drill was the love of my life. Um, so so wonderful, so beautiful, so powerful, so chill, so fresh, so dozer. <laughs> it, yeah, it. Um, I don't know. Like the, at the time. I think we've since surpassed it with uh, Mario Maker, but at the time, this was the longest-running Game Grub series ever, uh, Pokemon Fire Red, and uh, it was a real journey. We were like different people by the end of it <laughs> than when we started. Yeah, like was... like in Lord of the Rings, where they're like, we can't go back to who we were. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen that, but I understand that sentiment so right. so much. Um, Trevor Kelly, um, I'm sorry, it's pronounced bunt. Did comma <laughs> it's yeah i forgot about the comma oh yeah it's a very very pronounced part of the name yeah wow bapo vivo said how oh how beautifully that turned out two weeks ago they said that wow holy crap that's people, amazing people still calling back to those those b drill episodes that that's wonderful that, that, that's soon that is wonderful Makes me really happy geo dude sub <laughs> <laughs> geo dude it's not very effective oh no oh that's, that's not funny. good I think I'm. Oh damn! I think I might immediately die. Fell. Slowly <laughs> chip away. Oh, that's, that's not good. Him. Oh no! Oh. I never expected Bunt to die. Poor Bunt to. I don't know what I can do. I'm. I. I, I I'm. I'm woefully unprepared. Get, yeah. What? Bunt what? is evolving. He just turns into a huge penis. Bunt is so uh, evolving. Whoa! It's Whoa. a huge penis! It's a chrysalis! Oh, right. Huge penis! A barf. It's a huge penis. Oh! Wow. What it? I it's mean, it really does look like a huge penis. Was. No. Yeah. He gets really cute later, though. He turns into Beedrill. He also learned Harden. Mmm. <laughs> Don't even. <laughs> Don't even. So Boy, it's amazing, like, seeing those old names, like, Nert and Splart. Yeah. It's like, God. Because that's before we, um, our our lives were different back then. It was much more like we would stay up till 4 a.m. and and play Game Grumps because mm -hmm. we were living across the street from each other. Uh, so logistically, it was different. Um, that was the series and, where I was, like, hanging upside down on the bed at one point. Yes, yes. <laughs> 
whereas now we've we we lead a healthier lifestyle yeah. dare i say it uh with vegetables and sleep <laughs> um and and but god the, so, so there was some kind of uh loopiness that would come with doing an episode at 3 a.m mm-hmm. where uh it like we would just watch them back later and we we're like what were our brains even doing yeah seriously they, they, it was, there were some moments where it was just like you would watch it you'd watch something because sometimes you watch something and then you're like oh my brain goes to the same place like i'm about to say this and then i do and it's like mm-hmm. oh, okay that makes sense but like during pokemon it was like what yeah yeah <laughs> it was really funny but it almost killed us so it was sort of a give and take <laughs> yeah yeah it's like a glass cannon almost uh, yeah, let's see these comments. Mikan Sumiki approves this comment, says. <laughs> I completely <laughs> understand Aaron's love for Beedrill. Even if it might be sarcastic, I mained him in every game. You could catch him in just because he looked awesome, plus the Mega Evolution looks badass. That's so true! Nice. He's a bee with yep. needles on his hands. It's so dope. <laughs> you beat the Elite Four basically just with him. I Did I? I I'm pretty sure I, don't I had remember. to use somebody else. Well, I guess we'll I think find maybe out. you tried to do that and failed spectacularly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was. I. I have a feeling it might have ended sadly. I, it's weird that I can't remember exactly how it went. So this is going to be fun to rewatch. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, but yeah, the Kakuna is sort of disgusting looking. <laughs> yeah, a little. little <laughs> At penis, least in this version, penis ass. Yeah. Penis ass. By by the buttocks. <gasps> I know. Bunch is evolving. Scandalous. Oh. Bunch is evolving into my favorite Pokemon right now. Oh fuck, for real? He's one of my favorites. Oh my god! Motherfucking, uh, motherfucking, uh, Beedrill! <laughs> oh. <laughs> so cool. Beedrill, bitch! Wow, he's fucking awesome, actually. Yeah, he's a bee, and he has drills for arms. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> That's why his name's Beedrill. <laughs> he's got many beads around him like a craft project. I don't know where the real comes from. Whatever. Like a craft project. Like a cra- <laughs> What's that deep thoughts where he breaks up the word incorrectly? People often wonder why mankind is such a mystery. In order to figure this out, you have to break it down into its two trace words, mank and eind. <laughs> what do these words mean? No one knows. And therefore, mankind is a mystery. <laughs> it's like so fucking stupid. Mank and eind. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I... I forgot about his uh, when he first shows up. He's got like both his arms up, like what? Yeah, he's so splayed out. <laughs> like, come at me, bro! I'm fucking Beedrill. Yeah, a lot of things came at him. We threw him into a lot of battles. Yeah, that was well. I mean, you know, if you if you if you uh, <laughs> if if you come out looking like this, the world comes at you fast. Right. That's true. Um, so Seth Blizzard says. He quotes you saying, Beedrill's my man. He's like, oh boy, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that was a comment, like not having seen any of this. Like he's watching it for the first time and he's like, oh, jeez, here we go. Like just, yep. just knowing how hard I'm going to commit to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one, this next one's small. You want to read this for me? <laughs> Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Rain Dance Oberts says, Hey, Aaron, there's a Pokemon named Stunky. It is a skunk Pokemon with a face that looks like a butt. I thought you would be interested. Yes, I am a big fan of Stunky. I, I think Stunky what? is... Qu- oh, yeah. Stunky's great. Look him up. Stunky? Okay, hold on. Sorry, sorry everyone. Just hold, please, while I... <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, dude. They made his whole face look like a legit ass. <laughs> Yo, it's the whole wow. ass. It's the yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's beautiful. I mean, they, they, I'm surprised they even did that. They get creative, man. They they do what they can to make the kids happy. Wow. And and the the ass face skunk, like his face is not even the stank part of the skunk. Well, you don't know that he could have like face stink as a move. You're right. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh. Sweet. Oh yeah. Nice son. Motherfucking Zubat doesn't know shit about my fucking bee drill. Whoa. Yeah, you gotta watch out for my drill hands, yo. Yo, if he gets too close, he. I'm proud of you. That's what he does. <laughs> now I made it look weirder. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, chances of you ever being God? Slim. Slim to Sorry, slim to uh, dead zero. Oh, I forgot you had bee drill. Yeah, bee drill's the bomb, dude. <laughs> it's been a little while since. It, I don't know. There might be like a seamless like just Pokemon's, Pokemon's, Pokemon's every day. 
but it's been a little while since we played this from the last episode. <laughs> Yo, hold on for a second. Yeah, go ahead. Fucking... Yo, that shit wasn't super effective, all right? Okay. Fucking Zubat up in here. Right. It's all like, huh. Yeah. I mean, that's it. That's all I wanted to say. <laughs> Dude, uh, can I mean, you not like... interrupt my soliloquies? <laughs> I mean, look at his fucking face. The whole time he's like, oh! <laughs> kick your shit. He's adorable. Well, he might kick my shit because he looks very short. And well, he's... he can probably only get to poop height on the ground. Well, the, the, the best thing about him is that he's not odd. He's odd-ish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's just mm, kind of go, Bunt. Snack, uh, I always forget you put the comma in there. <laughs> Bunt. Mm. Schnink. Oh, my evasiveness. It fell. smells like your evasiveness is falling. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fucking missing attacks? This, this is, is definitely rough. like the, is very the rough. tired it's an 80 gameplay hit that we. Chance. You stay in every time. Oh yeah. Twenty percent roll, and I fucking missed it. Is he the um? Is he the last of Clark's guys? We sound drunk. I know, like yeah, a little dude, bit. Be Clark like a fucking year ago. Did you really? I completely zoned out while I was telling <laughs> that, that church story. Dude. Yeah, I'm sorry. I fought like two trainers Are since. you serious? <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. <laughs> I am so lost. Was well, that Clark's first guy? <laughs> yeah. Wait, I'm going to level up Bunt because I think he's cool. Please do. Check it out, yo. Bunt time. Yo, I want him to learn, like, a bug move and stuff, but he ain't got no bug moves, you know what I'm saying? You know what I thought was weird that, that I just realized? What? Didn't he come out of a cocoon? Yeah. Bees don't come out of cocoons. Not in real life. Right. This is Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. Cocoon. You know what? I guess the argument could be made that bees don't have drills on their arms either. <laughs> yeah, and they're not the size of people. Yeah. You know what? I stand corrected. Nothing makes fucking sense. Good. Good. I'm glad that you understand what Pokemon is. Good. I'm glad. Finally. Ah oh, shit, yo! Poison sting time. Blip, 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 blip. Yo, bitch is poison. Nidoran's like, hey, um, I've been meaning to tell you something. And they're like, yeah, what? And he's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have one tooth. <laughs> Jeez, oh, man. man. Oh, wow. It's so it's so wild because like, Pokemon got really popular in America, right? around the time where I went to college. Uh, I, th I was like 17, I think, when it, it started to get big. And um, so I sort of missed it. I sort of missed the boat. Mm -hmm. But you being a little bit younger than me, you were like right in there, oh, you yeah. know? And, and so playing this game was my education uh, on Pokemon. And at the end, I was quite well-versed, you know, in, in how everything goes. But man, it, it's... It's interesting to look back and 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 watch me learn all the things mm. that I'm like, yeah, of course. Now it's it's, it's a Nidorans, like <laughs> obviously, you know, but or Nidorans, I don't know how to say it. Well, um, Annie Merrill's coming at you with that uh, those those cold hard facts. Bees actually do come from cocoons. They're just embedded oh, in honey they? in the beehive. What? Yeah, it's a bit different, but bees have the same larva to pupa metamorphosis. And look at me. And six years after he or she made that <laughs> comment, I learned something. There you go. It's all about sharing that knowledge. Wait, so honey contains bee cocoons if, before if, we eat it? Yeah, so if I'm to um if I'm to remember this correctly, they're the way that they lay their eggs is in tiers. So there's mm -hmm. um there's there's like a long pit. And then, so they'll lay the female bees uh, far into the pit. And th so they'll lay one female bee, little pupa, egg, whatever. Um, and then they'll put what they call bee bread in with the, the little egg so that when it hatches, it has something to eat. And then they'll put like a layer of hive to just like completely cover it off. And then mm. they'll, and the next layer, they'll put like another female with like a slightly a little less bee bread. And then as it goes on, and it continues and continues, and then it gets to males, um, because the females are more valuable to like the sustainability of the hive than sure. the males are. Um, and then the males get less and less bread. So their biggest threats are wasps. So wasps will come in and they'll dig into the holes and they'll eat like a lot of the males as it goes down. And then they'll be like, all right, I'm done. And then they'll leave like the valuable wow. females yeah wow man hive mind stuff is crazy because who with independent thought would sign up for that like yeah i'll be in the eat me level 
<laughs> you just you just put me there. That's cool. I mean, it's all part of the it's all part of the duty of the hive to keep it alive. Yeah. You, know what I'm saying? <laughs> you said duty. <laughs> We've really grown as people. I think so too. Uh, Ricardo Pereira de Paula. This series is so inspiring. Makes me feel like playing the game all over again and form the shittiest team possible just to <laughs> attempt the same level of aggravation. Okay. All it right. started off so so complimentary. <laughs> Man, dude, I love this. I love watching them be idiots and not know anything about what they're doing. Yeah, we're happy to know we've inspired you to aggravate yourself by being as m- stupid as we are. <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's not the most fun thing it is fun though i will admit yeah yeah we had a good time all right here we go okay oh damn don't kill me don't kill me no. don't, don't, oh, yes! okay okay yes good, 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 good. Time! Good, good, good. oh shit he's getting absorbed in fucking shit all up in this room. Uh, wait, are we doing well it doesn't seem like we're actually making progress okay here's what's happening right okay, now okay. i'm gonna switch to bunt t- Okay. Oh shit! I'm gonna drain out his swift PP, right? Okay. Check. Please, I'm gonna use my fucking potions on this, on fucking Oddish. You know what I'm saying? Oh damn! Oh my god! Beedrill! No, he hung in there. You're so good. Beedrill's so fucking good, dude. Oh, two hit points left. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. This is this is very exciting. It's very exciting. Oh, rapid spin! Yo, that's a super effective move. <laughs> If it's more than two, he's done. Oh snap! This Goldeen is gonna get fucked up by my Beedrill, my bunt. Oh shit! Yeah, he has got so much punctuation. Be- Good run. <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. I know, I know. Yo, give me some credit. <laughs> Yo, I gotta come up with jokes on the fly, dog. Not on the beat. Damn, <laughs> damn. All right. <laughs> Good run. <laughs> you also denied my fucking. I, I, I wasn't. I wasn't ready for it. I'm ready for it now, though. Oh, okay. Has the moment passed? Can we yeah, still high five? Yeah, probably. Damn it. God. Gosh, man. Oops. What a different vibe. I can. I was just gonna say I can. I can actually feel the old couch underneath me, yeah. and I can <laughs> feel your old house. You know, and and just go into the kitchen and that giant bag of like no, the box of Skittles. exclusively Lucky Charms mushrooms oh, and the box right. of Skittles. <laughs> Did I say Lucky Charms mushrooms? mushrooms? I meant marshmallows. <laughs> Sorry. But Jeez. Yes, I remember the bag of the marshmallows. I would, I would uh, supplement my bowls of Lucky Charms with more marshmallows. Yeah. That's how yeah, it was in those then, early days, man. It was the wild west. It really was. And we just like, that that we just oh god we just did not take care of ourselves back then it, it was purely like I, now now i i'm grateful we can still do the show um while also maintaining a lifestyle that isn't destroying our bodies oh yeah yeah i i i just started a diet today so i'm like that all this all this quarantine of uh, all, all this quarantine fluff. I'm, I'm shaving off, baby. The quarantine fifteen, as they call it. <laughs> it's already I've been hearing that a lot. I guess it's been four yeah. months. So, y- yeah, sure, that's plenty of time. <laughs> Pixel, is it Pixel Tricks? Yep, Pixel yeah. Tricks says probably the highest level Beedrill I've ever seen. Uh, that's a man without willpower. I can tell you that. Oh uh, well. <laughs> or, someone with a life. Uh, I think I <laughs> think good training a drill is one of life's greater pleasures um, that needs to be experienced by all of uh, humankind. Do you think? It, and I don't know if these folks still watch the show uh, all these years later, but do you think any of them are expecting that one of the comments they made six years ago will suddenly be h- highlighted on one of our shows, and they're just sitting at home and they're like. <laughs> you know <laughs> yeah. finally oh my god <laughs> <laughs> that would be that would be marvelous I would be so into that can I get some substandard pizza and a look at an animatronic puppet and then the guy's like and then he gets fired because he's not supposed to talk true story wow oh he was in a costume yeah I thought he just had a problem. <laughs> <laughs> fucking oh, asshole. Can you still beat this guy? Oh. Yeah, man, I have... Dude, I have fucking... No, I met with Bunt. 
Bunt is a fucking beast, dude. Bunt is my best Pokemon. That's a lie. I just wanted to lie to you. I'm sorry. <laughs> you told me like three different ones. Your <laughs> I forgot Pokemon about him. Last, like, it's a really long episodes. commitment to this bit. Like, I, it's like I already, I, I, I wasn't paying attention to what episode that was, but I'm sure it was episode like 30 something. And it's like just full commitment to this. Like, <gasps> how dare you talk shit about Beedrill? <laughs> oh, yeah. And in real time, it was like months to get yes. to <laughs> that episode. Um, Yaragorm says, I'm fine with Beedrill and all, but the fact that they have a Charmeleon and aren't using it dr is driving me bonkers. Oh. Oh, Yaragorm. <laughs> so young. Uh, so, yes. My sweet summer child. <laughs> There's much dr driving about that Charmeleon. <laughs> driving our fans and ourselves bonkers is what this show is all about <laughs> and i'm um, you know i can't i can't claim to know what i was thinking six or seven years ago but i do like to think that i probably was deliberately not using the charmeleon just because it was like no beedrill's cooler i guarantee that's what it was <laughs> you you are a uh, you are a man uh, who who marches to the beat of his own insane drummer stupid drum <laughs> real ski says aaron goes into pokemon menu selects to switch pokemon picks beedrill makes goal to beat gym leader during episode purposefully goes out of his way to fight other trainers i don't know what i expected <laughs> <laughs> this person gets it oh yeah this is this is this right here encapsulates all of the game grumps experience right here mm -hmm. it's, i'm just i'm just <laughs> making a claim Breaking the claim, not doing it, doing something else, m messing with people, messing with the game. <laughs> yeah. I, I actually can't say if we do that as much anymore, but that was certainly 2013 style. Oh, yeah. That 2013 style. Ugh. Oh, those are the days. Staying up till Isn't 4 a.m. amazing? Oh, dear God. I'll go fucking up and around like an asshole. <laughs> Like an asshole. Oh, I could have even. I could have just gone up here and cut the tree. Oh come on, dude. cut the trees. Can, can, is Beedrill the only one that can do that? Yeah, he's got. He's the only one who knows cut. Really? So yeah. he's super helpful to have. Beedrill's my best fucking only Pokemon. Now <laughs> I better not say so shit about super, Beedrill. Uh, I won't. Yeah, he's awesome. What was Beedrill at the beginning? <laughs> oh, he's Kakuna. Oh, he's a Weedle. Oh, he's a Weedle. Yeah. That's right. He's a Weedle, and then he turns into a Kakuna. And then wow. he turns into motherfucking Beedrill, destroyer of worlds. Yeah, or at least one single tree. The fucking. same tree, <laughs> over and over. No, dude. Whoa, it's a fucking Pidgeotto, dude. God damn, that's, that's a massive dude, pigeon. Check out P fucking Beedrill's guns, dude. Yeah, look at him. Fuck. <laughs> Those pythons are sick. Oh my god. All of that. Do you fucking lift? <laughs> Beedrill fucking <laughs> lifts. <laughs> Do you lift, bro? He just like faints. <laughs> he lifts. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Able to like maintain that level of like excited energy. For dude, that that's long. episode 61. <laughs> just, dude, dude, you have no idea. For like fucking eight hours straight. What dedication to the craft. Oh. It's it's inspiring. Wow. Uh, James O'Burn said, Oh boy, can't wait to see how useful that Beedrill's going to be late game. Useful in quotes. <laughs> oh, James. James O'Burn. You have no idea what you're in for right now. Well, he does. This was six years ago. Okay, well. I mean, I'm talking to James <laughs> six years ago. Okay. I'm ta speaking through a time portal that's this big, and I'm like, James, James, you have no idea what you're doing. And he's like, huh? James. What? <laughs> <laughs> Is this because they posted that Game Grips comment? No, da oh, Nate C. says, no, Dan, I'm pretty sure you misunderstood, but that's okay. I'll teach you. <laughs> Almost all Pokemon can learn cut. Beedrill is just the only one Aaron taught it to. If he does ever choose to stop using Beedrill, he could teach it to another. Who am I kidding? Dan's never going to read this. <laughs> Oh, bud. He'll never notice me. Never know how much I love him. Oh, Nate C. Oh, no. I'm so sorry you had to go six years without knowing it. I love you, man. It's... Oh. Oh, that's so sad. What a journey. 
That's so sad. That's like those movies where the person finds like a love letter from someone they thought like it's like the notebook. Yeah. <laughs> I wrote you I wrote you every year. Oh, actually I, I've only I've only <laughs> seen the version of this scene where they use the goofy voices uh <laughs> over <laughs> over Rachel McAdams. She's like, I wrote you every day for a year. <laughs> you wrote me. I've only seen the version where uh, Kevin James is doing the sound test. You see that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just, it's like, I'm just trying. I'm just trying to get a sound test. What do you want? I'm just, <laughs> I'm just trying to. Just need to get sound. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, sorry. But anyway, Nate C., yeah. Um, consider yourself noticed, buddy. Yeah. LOTM says, Aaron, every other Pokemon in your party is stronger than Bunt. Let him go. You'll be better off. You see, oh, that's, that's a quitter's mindset. The, the, I was just going to say, this person does not know Aaron Hansen on a personal <laughs> level. Like, wh why would you give up on something that you've put so much effort into for so long and you want to be true? And isn't true, but you wish were true. Why would you give up on something like that? And someone saying that to you only ensures that you will redouble your efforts <laughs> to do it twice as much. That's so true. It's like, oh, let him go, huh? Huh? Let's mm -hmm. see how you like this. Yeah. <laughs> Level <right>. 99 Beedrill. <laughs> I need to get, I need to heal my Bidrill though, because Bidrill is in, a, is in a bad spot. Okay. And he's the one who's going to beat Koga. Is he? Yeah, Koga fucking sucks. <laughs> Against my Beedrill. <laughs> <laughs> Not against anything else. Beedrill's gonna fuck him up. Do it. Y you don't believe me. I do. No, you don't believe me. I don't. But... <sighs> I might start once the fucking up begins. Seriously, dude? Yep. I'm gonna run for his money. Oh, Bunt was the one that was gonna fuck everyone up, right? Yeah, and Bunt died. Yeah. Plumber, I know. Well... Um, fuck. Well, I don't... Shit, man. I mean, I do shit, but... Sure. You better finish this, because this episode's done after you knock this guy out. I know, but I'm going to use Beedrill, because he's the best character. Do it. Beedrill it, is... His name is Bunt. D d d I'm up. sorry, I'm sorry, Bunt. He's he's the best uh, Pokemon. Except for the other that are, like, considerably better in your own group, standing next to him. Thereby making the comparison extremely easy. No, he's, he's, he's just the best in general. He could beat Mewtwo. He could beat, um, Ar Arceus. I don't know if that's the Arceus. Is this... Is this perhaps a, a swing back at, at the the small amount of people who have said you should not have hitched your wagon <laughs> to making a Beedrill your main Pokemon? Is that perhaps what you're trying to suggest here? Beedrill is the best Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> and please, don't ever suggest otherwise. <laughs> I'm very sensitive about it. No, I, I, yeah, it's fine. I'm sure, I'm sure pin missile is probably the penultimate <laughs> weapon in any game. Pin ultimate? Yeah, I, next time on Game Grumps. First of all, I just wanted to comment. It's so interesting to hear us where we're going in and out of being sick all the time. I, oh, yeah. I totally forgot that was a thing, that we were always sick all the time. And now... Because we were taking horrible care of ourselves. That's right. And... Yep. Ever since I stopped using mouthwash, that's I haven't gotten sick. That's pretty amazing. That's pretty amazing. I never really used it, so I can't confirm or deny that that's a thing. I just thoroughly brushed. Mm. So, hmm. Floss. Yeah. <laughs> you, I, I, did you say I floss? Who cares? No, I said I. I said floss too. Oh, okay. <laughs> like floss. I floss. Too? Who cares? Yeah. True Patrol said uh, absolutely right. Beedrill's the best Pokemon ever. Thank you, Thank Trooper, you Trooper Troll. Thank you, Trooper Troll. I mean, they have the n n word troll right in their name, so maybe they're not that serious about it, but you never know. <laughs> and then Jetstream responded, except it's not. Okay, oh. Jetstream, sorry. <laughs> sorry, yeah. Made him wait for that sorry, too. Like, hit return a couple of times. It's <laughs> yeah. pretty good. Oh. Oh, I, guess, I guess computers don't really say return anymore. They just say enter. Yeah, yeah. They still have the oh, no, return no, no. symbol, though. Yeah, it says it says return on the on the iMac. Okay, cool. Oh, I, I, really? I, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All of my um, all of my PC I should say, not... keyboards say enter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, ho cakes! Two, two, two million subs when this came two, out. Aww. Two million subs. Can you believe that? That that meant yeah, that meant a great deal to us because there there was about one million when I first joined the show. So to like to to reach two was like a like a milestone in our lives. Yeah. I remember there was a lot of like hugging and high fiving. That was that was a nice day. It was a nice day. It was it was proof that you the best, baby. You the best. No, you the best. Stop. It's Jim. Oh my god. Yup. Yup. You cut. Uh, yeah, you yeah, son of a yeah, god damn it. I am dead. Oh good, a sky uppercut. No, it's no big deal. Israel can take it. So, oh damn. You see that shit? Good job. And I'm burned. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, well, whatever. <laughs> Nobody cares about Pedro anyway. I mean, oh uh, uh, no! Did, what did you say? Drill! Oh, <laughs> oh fuck, dude! <laughs> oh boy, not B drill. Do I mean, it. I, I actually can't. I'm kind of upset. <laughs> yeah, no. That's yeah, the, that's dead. that's your point, man. Yeah, B drill. B drill takes the fucking hits, man. Great job <laughs> of censoring the wrong thing. Oh, Psyduck. <laughs> Mr. Mark! Mr. Mr. Mark! <laughs> I forgot! <laughs> whoa, what was that? Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? Fucking priming, Damn, the dude! Cross chop! Come on! Alright, time to bring out the big guns. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> You're going motherfucking down, primate. Uh, Look at that! You see how much damage that did? Yeah, man. Oh, good, a seismic toss. Whatever, he's t he's seismic tossing a fucking bee. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. Last time I seismic tossed a bee, I fucking went home crying to my mom. Yeah, with stop doing that. Cut power. A mist? The hell? Ow. What the fuck? What oh, the fuck? Oh, God, just another... Just another strong showing for Bunt and, oh, and Beedrill's everywhere. Beedrill's fucking great. Done. <laughs> Come on, Beedrill's my best Pokemon, you know it. I, I do, I do. Aside from fucking Blue Pool, He's the best at fainting, that's for sure. Who I haven't used in a while. You yeah, know what? Fuck it. Yeah, Blue Pool could Blue fucking... Pool. I have a funny feeling. Yeah, what is that feeling? Yeah, that Golbat may not survive this. What, what makes you say that? I don't know. His death. <laughs> <laughs> Blue Pool's just like, yeah! Anyone else want a piece? <laughs> Yeah. I forgot you had Bloople and like other really excellent rare characters, but you'd still just shove Bunt into the into the fray. Every shove time. him! He was eager. That's true. <laughs> was, That's true. He was ready for competition because he's incredibly strong and he's confident in his abilities. Man, your eyebrows go up when you're intense <laughs> like that. Like what? I don't know How what you're you talking say that? about. <laughs> <laughs> just full like, full like like. Yeah, yeah. I will fucking <laughs> Jason Roof wrote Aaron and Dane should really give Beedrill Bunt a Megastone mm. Did we do that? I don't think that's a thing that you can do in this game Oh okay It's only in the other ones <laughs> Emily Einhorn says Are you serious? I can't tell if this is sarcasm Of course it's not sarcasm you fool Yeah Jason Roof <laughs> responded No dude it increases Beedrill's stats <laughs> Wow. <laughs> oh, he's talking about the Megastone. <laughs> yeah, and then Poketeers wrote, at Jason Roof, it is not in this game. <laughs> Nate Hoskin wrote, lol, mate, that's another game. <laughs> I love DJ Smooth, 116. <laughs> Am I the only one that actually wants Aaron and Dan to get Nert? Oh, we left Nert in the daycare for like oh, fucking yeah. seven years. <laughs> yeah, we that's right. That was a big joke of ours. He's going to come out of daycare, like, all jacked up and <laughs> huge. He's not even going to be eradicated. He's just going to keep being a Rattata, just huge and jacked. Is that a seashell chomping on that guy's ass? And he's like, yeah! Yep. <laughs> <laughs> More of that, please! <laughs> One guess to tell you what my fetish is! <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh shit, did I just beat that slow bro with a motherfucking bee drill? Yeah, like, yeah, I fucking did, internet. He's like, fine, I'm taking my ass chomp with me. <laughs> that just means I could be on the ground and get my ass chomped. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Down and out. You think, um, you could turn around, like we're the only other people in this room. No, he wants to look badass. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, Seth Blizzard wow. once again. Beautiful. Uh, Beast Drill's just average. The joke's getting old, Aaron. It's snowing on Mount Fuji. <laughs> oh, it's snowing on Mount Fuji. Wow, that's interesting. Because it's snowing on Mount Fuji happened in a Sonic playthrough, I think in 2014. Mm. So, now, this is a year later, and you're still doing the Beast Drill joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Man, those were the days, man. It was just like, the the... It was just omnipresent, like the the Pokemon playthrough. We would just like go back yeah. to it every so often. It really was in our lives a long time. So strange. Anderson Smith writes Beedrill's his best Pokemon. Even Aaron said so. <laughs> 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 Gotta See? take the man at his word. <laughs> I'm the authority on all Beedrillness. Oh, there's a response to this haiku. I do like Beedrill. The joke is never leaving. It's snowing on Mount Fuji. <laughs> Sovereign Snorlax wrote, Slowbro is weak to Beedrill. Oh. Dewatcha25 wrote, I had one of those high alert poops <laughs> last night. Heading home after dinner and drinks with friends. My stomach revolted against me. Was it the Thai slash beer slash whiskey combo? I don't know. What I do know is that it was the longest 15 minute drive home ever. But I made it and that poop was horrendous. Oh, hey, Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> that's that's like something you would write. That's a great comment. I'm gonna pin that. Yeah. I'm gonna put that I on love, the wall. Pin that from five years ago. Yeah, I'm gonna pin that on the the upload. <laughs> you know what I'm just saying? Just in time. Yeah, just so it was, appears on top for everybody. Well, time to surf. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, I'm not gonna surf. I gotta I gotta fucking use Bunt, dude. He's the best. Oh. <laughs> yeah. No, he really is actually. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. He's very strong. Check it out, watch this, Twin Needle. I'm gonna kick his ass. Boop! Super motherfucking Damn. effective. Yeah, and people said Beedrill wasn't great. Crit hit, bitches! That was a fucking Kadabra, dude. That was a top tier Pokemon, and I just fucking wrecked it with my Beedrill. Is he top tier? Uh, well, his evolution is. It's Abra, then Kadabra, then... Alaka fucking Zam, dude. Oh, shit. Yo, that's like, part of that is a Shaq movie. So don't second guess it. <laughs> <laughs> I won't. Uh, yeah, so you see how Beedrill is fucking wrecking everything? <laughs> yeah, he really is kicking ass. Well, Why is that? Hmm. Oh, it's interesting, right? <laughs> it's almost like he's a good Pokemon. <laughs> I just love when there's like an ounce of confirmation. I just, I, I'm just like swimming in it. I'm like, oh, told you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I get the feeling uh. that all this praise from Aaron is going to give Bunt a superiority complex. A superiority complex. Um, good. He deserves it. Exactly. See, you get it, Dan. You understand. Yeah. Well, I've long since just given up <laughs> fighting it. <laughs> just, uh, just sad impressed. Simba. Sad Simba writes: Beedrill kicks more butt than my dad. I wish my dad could tear through wildebeests like that Beedrill is tearing <laughs> through those psychic types. Then maybe he wouldn't be dead, and it wouldn't be all my fault. <laughs> What is this like? What are people RPing in our in our comments? <laughs> this is my sad Simba RP account that I use to comment on <laughs> YouTube videos. It's <laughs> <laughs> so good. That shit was sad, man. I recently watched The Lion King and I cried. I definitely <laughs> cried. Oh, oh, it's it's terribly sad. That's why Simba's so sad. <laughs> Matthew Capo Bianco says psychic is weak to bug, dark, and ghost. It's really clever because those are the three primal fears. Oh, that's really sweet. Interesting. Ah. Oh. Bug, dark, and go are they really primal fears? I don't know. They are pretty scary though. Gore six one nine forever uh, says yeah, Aaron Beedrill is totally a good Pokemon. It can't be because he is nine levels above everything. Nah, that part's irrelevant. 
Mm. It, it is a real. And then sixty-one people replied, <laughs> but <laughs> what a fucking I can't go can't go down that rabbit hole. <laughs> <laughs> it has little to nothing to do with level, says LWB's dreams. It's a bug type Pokemon using bug type moves against psychic type Pokemon. <laughs> exactly, that's what I'm saying. Wow, you you want to you want to get in there and reignite that that flame war that lit up a little while ago? Fight me in the comments. Five years dude. ago. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, Sammy Bull. Sammy Blee. I can't read it too well. Yes, Aaron was totally being serious when he said Beedrill is the best Pokemon. It can't be that he was just joking around. Nah. Um, oh, damn. This got, this got heated. Do I look like I'm joking to you? You fools. Umbrella says, how about you can use all Pokemon? How about it is not about what is overpowered, but what you like? Now get in your van and get the fuck out of this town. Oh, my Whoa! God. <laughs> this is like... It, this is like that thing we've talked about, that phenomenon with YouTube comments where... It starts off with like, yeah, you know what? Beedrill is the best Pokemon. And then there's 150 replies and like you get to the 150th and it's like Hitler missed a few Jews, <laughs> you know, like it's just like, whoa, whoa what? Jeez. Like, geez. <laughs> Why did yeah. it get here? Yeah. It's just crazy. Skit Ninjas responded heatedly to, oh, maybe we play competitive Pokemon. How about you get into your van? Oh, Dang, and then Carne Guisada wrote, why don't y'all settle this over a Pokemon battle like real trainers? Oh, shit. Damn. Yo. Has this been going on the whole time in our comment section? I had no idea. Skylar Campo and Skylar <laughs> delivers the final blow. How can butts be real if our tongues aren't? <laughs> what an incredible question. <laughs> Thank you for putting everything in perspective, Skylar. Yeah. I was just about to comment, so like, now that we don't have a walkthrough, are we fucked? Oh, Spark's dead. <laughs> Ooh, that was a critical hit, dude. That's nice. how big fucking Beedrill is. Everyone's shitting on me for Beedrill. I had some guy come up to me at, at the at the, the last unicorn thing. Oh, the last unicorn thing. Wow. Let's talk okay. about that. Yeah. All right, in a minute. Tell your thing. Which was really nice. But like, he came, he came up to me, well, he came up to you with his friend. And clearly didn't give a shit about me. Mm -hmm. And then, and then he was all like, "Oh man, you're great, Dan. You're the best. Oh, you're the coolest." And you were like, "Oh, thanks, man." And I was like, "I was like, oh, that's nice." And he like took a picture with you, and then he like walked away. And then his friend walked up to me and was like, "Fucking Beedrill, man. What?" <laughs> it's like hurting your standing in the community. <laughs> Do they did, did did they not know that you're trolling people? Uh, I don't know. Okay. I I don't know anymore. Yeah. I think I think it started off as trolling and now you're like, no, no. I'm, not I'm gonna make this work. No, Beedrill's not a troll. He's my favorite Pokemon. Is he really? No. <laughs> no, I'm trolling. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Why do you always believe everything I tell you? I, I really Sheesh. You, like fucking flinched. <laughs> oh my god. All right, so the last unicorn thing that we were referring to was a screening of the last unicorn mm. where we actually met Peter Beagle, who was the, the author of the book, who right. was so wonderful, such a nice guy. Um, but that was in January of 2015. So now we have been playing this game for two calendar years. Wow. Yeah, I mean, like, that's that's really amazing to, like, watch this whole progression all the way through. I did not realize that it was like that. And, like, the full commitment to these bits. Wow, how impressive. Oh, just your, your commitment to annoying people was <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> my, commitment to, my commitment to being passionate about my creatures, Dan! <laughs> So, Lozander says, I didn't expect my friend to lie either, but he told me Beedrill was a good Pokemon. And then a sad face. Aww. Um, your friend is, uh, really right, and you just are using him wrong. Pot Roast says, <laughs> what, he doesn't actually like Beedrill? I was so happy about that, because I love Beedrill, and I thought I was the only one. I'm about to cry now. No, Pot Roast! You don't understand! The, the part about me saying emojis. it was a bit was a bit. <laughs> Wow, yeah. that that person was crying a lot. 
with semicolons. It's a lot of crying faces side by side, yeah. sharing each yeah. an eyeball. I hope it hurts you, Aaron. <laughs> it, it, it does. It does, actually. <laughs> to see that I hurt somebody by them not being sure if I'm serious about Beedrill or not. You don't understand. Oh, I love Beedrill. God. My God. They were out of... Yeah. <laughs> And uh, I, I you just, remember when I took it upon you remember my, remember remember when they lost their minds. I took it upon myself. There's something so fuck. Ah, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I took I took it upon myself to go to two island. They were on one island, so now I'm on two island. Oh, okay. Oh, it looks like it'd be cut. Very. If um, only you had the sweetest Pokemon of all time. Yeah. I mean, who the fuck else could cut but Beedrill? Can anyone learn cut? No. <laughs> I honestly don't know. Oh. oh, hello. Welcome to my shop. He has drill hands, so... Oh, I see. It, it helps him cut better. Because he's my namesake. <laughs> the Lobster! Hey, Lobster! Yeah. Hey, bro. See, I could replace Beedrill. Oh, I'm yeah. i replace uh, Fun. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Look at that fucking ditto. He's like... <laughs> <laughs> Really good Pokemon I? that we got. <laughs> oh my God. Pokemon, and he's like, "Say hello to Clefki." <laughs> yeah. Just pulls out. Episode one hundred and six. <laughs> he's rooting around in his pockets frantically. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like if he'd happen to have had a condom in his pocket, like we'd have a Pokemon that was like ribbed for your pleasure. I think he's. Yeah, this is. This is sorry, I just wanted Beedrill to do something. He's doing great. Are you kidding? <laughs> Is he the one constant Pokemon we've had since we got him, like, yes. in our group? Yes. Wow. He's the only Pokemon that hasn't changed. Wow, Aaron. <laughs> you are- like, when you are dedicated to something, you will fucking- <laughs> You will run with it for a hundred episodes. Beedrill is the best Pokemon. Do it, Bloople. Nobody understands his true power, his yeah. true nature. Meanwhile, we've just replaced him with a legendary Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> well, he knows Fly. Fly is strong against Machoke. Oh, is it really? Yeah, so... Because you can't choke something if it's flying. Exactly. Yeah, fly. makes sense. Couples night. Dude, then they fucking make out. They straight up make out. Ugh. I want to see it. I love how they have to just, like, be like, Yeah, it's, it's, it's... She's got two cups! She's a girl! She's got boobies! And Nitto, Jeez, Nitto King's man! Got, Nitto King's got pecs! Like a man! Dude, you just fucked up your B. Yeah. Beedrill's alright, man. <laughs> he's good. He's good, that one. Oh shit, you've got your fucking... Now you got both your, uh, legendary jams. At... Yeah. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> shit. I thought we were- I thought it was just like the other badges where like you fight one and then... regroup. <laughs> this is actually perfect, cause... I'm gonna lose, first of all. And second of all, um... This is the last episode we're doing today, so I'm gonna train off screen. Cool. And, uh... Get uh, get bunt up to up to speed. Can I just say, like, as an aside, I'm really, I'm really get bunt up to speed. Yeah, dude. Yeah, no, not get the third legendary fucking bird that you can get. No, I gotta get my B, <laughs> fucking really jacked up for this. My B. <laughs> yeah, so it's your B. Uh, God damn it! Uh, Why don't you use your fucking B? Pikachu, go! Splart's only level 32? I wonder he sucks. <laughs> but, oh no! <laughs> no way, it'll never kill him. Uh, All right, you just uh, see him, he's like, wait, why am I here? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Bunt. It's your time If to only fly. we had a bee that could have flown over that wave, right? <laughs> chink chink! Dang. Chink chink! You just got served. <laughs> Hit two times. And each time was two things. <laughs> That, that's four times, that's right? Four. Well, I am dead. <laughs> uh, that's good, right? Damn, dude. No. Yeah. Laura Lee is not going to be impressed by you. Really four. Wow. <laughs> what a marathon. That, that's funny. Okay, Afro Mang uh, says, "I can't wait for tomorrow's episode. I want to see how much leveling Aaron's done off screen and if he's changed out any of his Pokemon to challenge the Elite Four. Seriously, Splart. Oh, seriously, Splart has to go." Has got to go. Yeah. Well, they're not wrong. Yeah. I'm not sure how much leveling off screen I did. I think it might have been zero. <laughs> Big Boss Giga says if Aaron beats the Elite Four with a fucking B drill, I'll admit he's one of the best Pokemon trainers out there. That's right. Wow. Yep. That's right, Big Boss Giga. 
full respect. I'm, I'm going to awesome. get your respect by the end of this compilation. <laughs> What's up, babies? Hey, babies, 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 mm. babies, babies. This mm. is the next, uh... This is the next filming session. Um, you can see that I have teleported to the power plant. Look at you. Uh, those of you in the know in the Pokemon world know what legendary That's me. bird You're talking lies. To me. What? Sorry, go on. You're talking about me. What legendary bird lies inside the power plant? That's Greg, by the way. The what? The bird? No, this guy. Oh, okay. I would. Can we name the bird Greg? <laughs> yes. Okay, sweet. Um, I have switched out my Pokemon uh, by oh, popular shit. request. Uh, just the Pikachu. He is now fucking again. Yeah, you, um, you, you cut out uh, you cut out all the fucking useless shit. Yep. Except for that Beedrill. <sighs> well, well actually, gone. he's the he's the best Pokemon. Really? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh fuck! It's Greg. <laughs> Greg, you son of a bitch. Why well, you came all the way here? Maybe you're a Pokemaniac too. Want to see my collection? Don't ever say that to me. Man. Of one. <laughs> <minute>. <laughs> Back in we go. <laughs> All right, next time on Game Rose. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's next. <laughs> oh yeah. All that's left is the Elite Four. Well, we gotta keep. Like, is there another uh, Pokemon out there that we could use to improve our crew? Well, let me see. What do I got? I got all three legendary birds. God knows they kicked the shit out of you when you tried to fight them. And I'm gonna get rid of Golduck for Zapdos. So I'm gonna have the best Pokemon <laughs> You're in the not world. Gonna get rid of Beedrill. <laughs> What? What the fuck? Why would I do that? <laughs> I, I don't know. It's a really silly thing to say. I mean, didn't. All right. Turnt Snacko. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna see what I can do to get Turnt Snacko to be more than he can be. Okay. If you catch my drift. Yeah. All right. So what I think is gonna happen? Um, I think we're gonna have to take a break from Pokemon. Okay. Uh, because I gotta train. Because this. Th this team, Sucks. aside from the Beedrill, <laughs> is not gonna take on the Elite Four. Right. Um, because I think fucking Gary is like level 70. Oh my god, are you serious? Yeah, so... What the hell have we been doing this whole time? We've well, been playing this game for like a year and a half. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 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 do you laugh? Uh, do you laugh at my pain? You just sound like every comment I've ever read. Oh, okay. It's serious. But we ha we've been playing this since like 2013. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, about that. Um, so yeah, uh, we'll take a little break. We'll come back and I will smash the Elite Four. All right. Into juice. <laughs> Delicious oh, juice. I'll masticate the Elite oh, Four. I'll miss wow. Pokemon. Dawson Clark <laughs> noticed that it, this episode was published on February 15th, 2015. Next episode coming soon. Current date, April 12th, 2016. 2016? This yeah. went into 2016? Oh, man. Do you remember? It was the whole fiasco. We played this like, game for four years? Well, somebody was going to... One of your friends was going to power level... All my Pokemon. Yes, that's right. And, that's right. And it was it was a promise that we kept making on other episodes of Game Grumps. Like, don't worry, Pokemon's coming. We're going to power level. And it just yep. took so long. She did it, though. Yeah, she did. Yeah. God bless her. She, she, I, I could, I could text her right now and congratulate her uh, on a job well done. Because I, but didn't she only make Beedrill strong? Wasn't there something like that? <laughs> this has been, so, this is so long ago. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't remember. Well, I guess we'll find out. I guess we will. I guess we will. <laughs> Here's to wow. the fire red finale in 2016, says Grep. Oh, um, oh my God. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's uh. Oh now now it's now it's oh man now we're going into mentions of oh. of, of B drill in other series. Well. Oh my God. <laughs> well, we'll. We'll catch up on this next time on the next compilation. Okay. Um, <laughs> tune I guess in next it'll time be like, for the second. Yeah, I saga. guess it'll be. I'm sorry. Yeah, I guess it'll be mentions of of Beedrill in other playthroughs, and then eventually, when we did finally finish it, I cannot believe we started in 2013 and ended in 2016. <laughs> Maybe it might have been 2017. I don't even know. Three glorious years of Beedrill, baby. <laughs> Unreal. How wonderful. Well, tune in next week. I said week. four. Yeah. I said four because I was actually counting 2013 as one of the years. No, that's like 2013, true. 14, 15, 16. But Oof. yeah, it's bananas. It's bananas. Well, join us Join us next week where you will see the conclusion of this Beedrill saga. Um, and we will be right there with you. Wow. Thanks for joining us. Yeah. What, what a trip. What a journey.
such a journey, such a long journey. Later. See ya.